One of my latest additions to my skincare routine has been making this homemade DIY rose water. Rose water is an anti-inflammatory, antiseptic and antibacterial, making it fantastic for soothing irritated and flamed skin like acne, eczema and rosacea. What's more, it can help reduce skin redness, treat infections, prevent further swelling and help cuts, burns and scars heal faster. As rose water is rich in antioxidants, this makes it very helpful in regenerating and strengthening skin cells. Adding some rose water to your natural conditioner or shampoo may also help soothe an irritated scalp and control dandruff. When it comes to sourcing ingredients, high quality organic pre-made rose water can cost quite a bit, whereas purchasing the organic rose petals only cost me a few dollars and I can make my own DIY rose water at home to use in my recipes or natural beauty products. So if you're looking to make your own, here's how to make a simple homemade DIY rose water using organic fresh or dried rose petals. This hydrosol can be used in recipes, for skin, as a natural facial toner, in a body moisturiser, in beauty products like a natural perfume or deodorant, as a scented room mist and more. When making a flower water or hydrosol, it's ideal to use fresh flowers from the garden or those purchased from a local organic farmer that you know hasn't sprayed any chemicals. The best hydrosols are made with flowers that are in season, which is when they're most fragrant. However, you can make rose water using dried petals too, and the process is the same. To make this rose water, start by placing a small, heatproof bowl at the centre of an empty saucepan and add the 1 cup of dried rose petals or 2 cups of fresh rose petals around the bowl. Make sure not to get any petals inside the bowl as this is where the rose water will collect. Then, add enough water to cover the petals in the saucepan and place the pan on medium-low heat and bring to a simmer. Place the lid on top but sit it upside down. Once the water begins to simmer, add ice to the top of the saucepan lid. This distilling process will turn the rose water vapour into water which will collect in the bowl inside. As soon as the ice starts to melt, add more ice cubes. Continue to add ice and allow the petals to simmer for about 30 minutes or until the colour of the petals fade and some clean, clear rose water has condensed into the bowl inside. Carefully remove the bowl from the saucepan and allow the rose water to cool completely. The leftover petals can be composted and the water, once cooled, can be poured over the garden. Pour the rose water into a clean glass bottle for storage and use as needed. You can store the rose water in a cool, dry place. And that's how you make your very own homemade DIY rose water. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Let me know if you make your own rose water at home and how it goes for you. I'd love to know. Take care and I hope to see you again soon.